previously on Minecraft Story Mode. Everything in the universe starts out as just a block. What comes of those blocks is up to those who wield them. And in every block, there lies the potential to create or destroy. Our friends have traveled far and wide in search of the Order of the Stone. And a way to stop the Wither Storm for good. But even well-laid plans can go awry. The strong can grow weak. And beloved heroes can fall. threat to this world, to its very existence, is far from over. Where, where am I? What's happening? What is all this? And that, that smell. Witherstorm isn't dead yet, not even close. The what? Do I know you? Jesse, Jesse, where are you? Say something, Jesse! We're over here! No way, no way! You found Petra? Who is Petra? Get out of here now! This way! Jesse! You made it! Uh, Petra? Your missing friend? Look out! <laughs> Those Endermen are running the wrong way! They'll be killed! Soren? I can't stand by and watch! I'd be condemning them to death! Soren, who cares? Who cares? I've devoted my entire life to these creatures. So you're ready to die for them? Well, no. <laughs> Jesse! They're falling behind! Axel, you gotta move faster! He's too sick. This is the best we can do. They're not gonna be able to outrun it. Not on foot! We gotta find a way to move faster. We're all gonna be caught in the tractor beam. Can we build a portal? If somebody has the right materials. We don't. I haven't seen Obsidian since the end. We'll have to use the next best thing. Everybody, get on! Jesse, we got this. We'll take the reins, and they can just hang on. I'll take Gabriel. Then I've got Petra. Hold on, this might be a bumpy ride. <laughs> Come on, horses! Whatever you do, don't look back. Ah! I looked. Everyone follow me! Just look <laughs> ah, this is awesome!
It's gaining on us! Pick up the pace or we're all done for! First time on a horse here! Watch out! Sorry. Excellent horsemanship, Jesse. Is that what this is called? made it. Jesse, Petra was saying some pretty weird stuff back on that horse. She was inside the wither. She might have wither sickness. I don't know. You never acted the way she's been acting. I'll go talk to her. Hey, how are you feeling? I don't really feel... Like myself? I still can't believe you're even alive. Do you not recognize us? I'm Axel. This is Olivia. The Witherstorm did something to her. So she doesn't remember anything? Not even me? Who can forget me? Jesse, this is awful. You, Jesse. You're the one who rescued me. Tell me, please, what is going on? All I remember was endless blackness. And then you were there. All that matters is you're safe now. Your friends are here, Petra. If you say so. All I know is I was so scared in there. I thought for sure I was dying. Well, you didn't. You made it back alive. That's more than I can say for some of us. Oh, man. Eligard. For a second, I almost forgot. Are we talking about Eligard? Yeah. Ah, oh, Ellie. Still can't believe the old girl's gone. How? How could this have happened? To lose not just a friend but a member of the Order of the Stone. All I know is she'd want us to keep fighting, no matter what. In fact, she'd tell us that we had to. <laughs> You're right, she would. Indeed. Ma! Being emotional is getting us nowhere! What I want to know is what happened out there today. Why is that thing still alive? My instructions were simple. You tell me. Excuse me? Well, you're the one who thought we could destroy the command block with a big old bomb. So the command block is still out there? Of course it is. Oh, great. And now, to make matters worse, we've gone from one weather storm to three. Our plan was a total failure. I should have cast the foul thing into the abyss. Soren, why didn't it break? The Formidabomb was, like, the strongest weapon imagined. Oh, uh, why are you asking me? Nobody's ever built one until now. Ugh. <sighs> I need a moment to think. 
Is he always like this? <laughs> you have no idea. That jacket, it looks familiar. Lucas always wears that jacket. No, I saw other people wearing it when I was being thrown from that, that monster. Ah, even thinking about it hurts. Hey, hey, it's okay. Jesse, if what Petra said is true, I mean, do you think? I thought for sure they were gone, but you realize there's a strong chance that Petra is totally confused? But what if she's not? Listen, if my friends are alive, I've got to go after them. They might need me, Jesse. <gasps> the room. Everything's spinning. You're okay. Easy does it. Gravel? No. Dirt? Don't think so. Lucas, what are you doing? I told you. I'm going after my friends. I thought the other ocelots were dead. But if they're not, I need to go find them. Look, I am grateful to you guys for bringing me this far. But I can't leave them alone out there. And what if Petra's wrong? In case you haven't noticed, she's not exactly firing on all cylinders at the moment. I've got to try, Jesse. Otherwise, I just couldn't live with myself. But Lucas... Jesse, let's be honest. You've never really treated me like I belong with you guys. You once even told me to stay away from Ruben. So it's time I go find my real friends. I mean, it's probably past time anyway. Trust me, you won't even miss me. You're being stupid. You could get killed out there. And wanting to help my friends makes me stupid? I don't need this. I'm going after the people who get what friendship actually means. over cobblestone might come in handy. Petra, how are you doing? Are you remembering things yet? I... I don't know. These little flashes keep coming back to me, but then they float away again. We've been trying to talk to her, but... It's like she's never met us before. I know I've met you before. Before today, I mean. I just don't remember... how... Exactly. I keep seeing a dark alley, but then that turns into trees. You totally came to my rescue in the forest, remember? I think that pig was there, right? It, Reuben, yes! And he was better at fighting than you, right? Uh, hey, I, I wouldn't say that. Yes, it's working. You're remembering Jesse. Do you remember me, too? No. And yet... I feel like I know all of you, somehow. Maybe it's the way you're dressed. Something's ringing a bell. Axel's practically obsessed with you. He was willing to do anything to get back at the guy who swindled you. Uh, to be fair, I probably would have stolen something from that jerk anyway. Wait, didn't we all fight that wither thing together? Yes! We totally did! She remembers it! I remember her running to a, a, a temple in the woods, and we were going to be safe there, and how did I end up inside that thing? Um, well, something bad happened there. I just, I can't remember what. It's not important now. It's over. You're safe. You're probably right. I was just hoping I'd remember. All that matters is you're with us now. And that you're still a fighter. The best one I know. So, what do you say? Will you be part of our group again? All right. Count me in. Jesse. Hello. Just making the rounds. I know you're not feeling well, Gabriel, but we can't stay here long. We have to keep moving. As much as I wish I could leap to my feet and launch myself back on that horse, I... <coughs> I'm running 
running on fumes here. You need to rest. You're right, I do. Look, Jesse, wherever you guys go next, give him some time to get his strength back. Problem is, we don't have time. Jesse's right. In fact, it might be best if my journey ends here. This cave is safe, easy to defend. It's relatively comfortable. I might even find a shred of peace. Forget it, Gabriel. I won't let you hole up in a cave while the rest of us fight. You think I want this? No, Jesse, but... I'm sorry. There's nothing more I can do. <sighs> nothing had to turn out like this. If the order had just been different, if we'd made smarter choices, Ivor wouldn't have turned into a maniac and... Well, maybe Yellow Guard would still be alive. Come on, let's, let's not talk about the old days. But how can we not? So many lives torn asunder. Doesn't matter how this started or who started it. We just have to end it. You're right. I know you're right. I only wish I could continue to help. All this talk of the past has me exhausted. You need to rest. Will he be okay? I don't know. Just get back out there and kick some butt for the both of us. Ugh, a pig? Reuben! Oh, not again. Reuben! Run off on me like that, okay? I don't want to lose you, you understand? What? Yeah, I know you've run off before, but things are different now. We've lost too many people already. I hate to say it, but the order failed. Part of me was still holding out hope that they could fix things, but I guess I should have known better. You're really not making me feel better, Reuben. That's what I said, isn't it? Oh, just as you once helped us before. This isn't about the past, it's about the future. There are three of those things now. You say that like it's my fault. It is your fault. Oh, take responsibility for once, Soren. Soren, you need to listen to me. Oh, what good has ever come of that? Haven't you done enough, Ivor? Like, say, single-handedly destroying the entire world? Well, technically I set in motion a series of events whose end result appears to it's be... It's the same thing! What you don't understand is, you are all in very grave danger. <laughs> Obviously! No. I mean specifically this group. The Witherstorm isn't acting randomly. It's following Gabriel. Gabriel? You see, I may have programmed it to follow his amulet. You mean the Order's amulet? Yes, Soren. That amulet. Oh, don't be so dramatic. Did you also know I was the one he gave the amulet to? What? I... I didn't know. Ah, Ivor, you fool. You've created a monster that's following Jesse, and it's only getting stronger. You don't think I realize that? Nothing can stop those things. Nothing even hurts them. Well, except Enderman. Enderman? Jesse's right. The Withers gaze passed over them, and they went wild. Soren, do you think Enderman could actually destroy one of those things? Well, it's not beyond imagination. If there were enough of them working together, it's a promising concept, at least in theory. If I'm seeing all the pieces correct. Could you coordinate the Endermen somehow? Make them attack all at once? If I know my Endermen, all we'd need to do is get them into the storm's vicinity. In fact, there's probably more than enough of them still in my fortress. 
An unintended side effect of you flooding the end. This is just like the old days, Soren. You and your crazy ideas... Hush! Ivor, for once! Ugh! Question is, how to bring the Storms and the Endermen together? Endermen aren't pets. They don't follow orders. At least, not for mere mortals. Isn't it obvious? The fortress is the key! If we can't bring the Endermen to the Witherstorms, we bring the Witherstorms to the Endermen. Just one problem. You're forgetting about the command block! Ugh, oh, yes. It's clear now that no weapon can destroy it. Not even a formidable. Actually, I may have a solution to that. You see, when I first took possession of the command block... You mean, stole it? Yes, well, I created a failsafe. A backup plan, for just in case. Well, I'd say just in case is here. Ivor, how could you keep this secret? Oh, believe you me, keeping secrets is easy. So I made something. An enchanting book. One that contains the power of the command block itself. Use it to enchant a weapon, and you'll be able to smash the command block to bits. Forever! Yes. Yes, that's it. It could very well solve all our problems. What are we waiting for? Let's go get that book. Just one problem. It's at my secret lab, which is sort of far away. How far could it possibly be? Let's just say it's the farthest place a person can travel before being utterly... Oh dear, what was that? How did it find us so quickly? It just keeps coming for us. Well, we can't stand around and wait for it. We need to get out of here right now. Ivor says that if we don't, that thing will... Ivor! It is you! Good to see you too, Magnus. Anyway, Ivor's figured out that Witherstorms are drawn to the amulet, so we're going to lure them back to Soren's fortress and destroy the command block with an enchanted super weapon. You figured all that out just now? The point is we need to get moving. We aren't safe. Not as long as we have that amulet. I'll take it. You can't. I can, and I have to. Axel, are you sure? Of course not. But you'll have three Witherstorms chasing you wherever you go. Yeah, if things get too intense, I'll duck into the nether or something. I'm tired of always being the selfish one. You just go make that super weapon. I'll meet you back at Soren's fortress. I want to go with Jesse. That feels like where I belong. Me too. But what do we do about Gabriel? The rest of you go. I'll stay here with Gabriel. Are you certain? Yeah. For old time's sake. Besides, I'm not going anywhere with Ivan. But Lucas is out there all by himself. There's nothing you can do for him. Guys, we need to go, now. Hey, Jesse. Let's try our handshake again, just once for the road. The griefer grab? You got it. <laughs> I'll see you at Soren's, all right? Not if I see you first.
we there yet? Not much further now. No, 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 we are not there yet. My butt's never been so sore in my life. Not that I remember. <sighs> Feels like we've been riding forever. I am telling you, we cannot go to the Far Lands. They're not just the edge of our world, but the limits of our comprehension. Oh, please. The Far Lands are a happy accident. Nature's way of keeping life interesting. No, no, no. They are perilous and unpredictable. Perlin noise, floating points. These are not matters to be toyed with. Why are you so down on the Far Lands, Soren? They sound cool. See? Jesse thinks the Far Lands are cool. The Far Lands lie at the very edge of all things, where logic gives way to chaos. They're a dangerous place to visit, and a ridiculous place to construct a laboratory. <laughs> Just wait until you see it. Do those two never stop arguing? You asking me? All I can think about is food. No kidding. I'm starving. Maybe we should turn back? This isn't the time. Swamps are too dangerous. You never know what might be lurking around. What was that? My stomach. Guys, we can't turn back now, not after coming so far. Fine, but I'm taking a break. So am I. We mustn't linger long. The Far Lands are just beyond this swamp. So this could be our last chance to find food? <laughs> Potatoes. Maybe it makes me a bad friend, but I just love potatoes. Hey, Jesse, have you found any food? They call Reuben a pig. So mm, good. A witch's hut. Yeah. We should steer clear of it. Nothing good ever happens when witches are involved. Look, a cake! That's... that's enough to feed everyone! It isn't worth it, Jesse. Witches hate trespassers. Besides, there are plenty of potatoes around. Is that a witch? Jesse, we shouldn't be here. 
witches are very strong. Ivor, I can't pass this up. I need you to watch my back, okay? I'm telling you, this is a bad idea. I'll keep watch. Just be quick about it. A potion of leaping. Cool. Wonder what horrible stuff's been brewed in there. Ivor. I thought he was with you. I don't know. He disappeared outside the witch's hut. Curse that fool of a man. Come on! Guys, I think we lost them for... Wow! You lost them for wow? What is that... It's like we're at the edge of the world. Actually, we seem to be at the corner of it. Welcome to the Far Lands, my friend. I'd feel a lot better about going into this crazy wall thingy if I wasn't still hungry. I'd rather be hungry than boiling in some cauldron. I'd rather be eating dinner. <laughs> Quite a sight, isn't it? Stretching skyward in all its glory. This wall? Did Ivor build this? No, of course not. This is a natural phenomenon. The intersection of two of the great walls that form the boundary of our world. Feeling kind of overwhelmed right now. You're not the only one. It doesn't seem as scary as I imagined it. Huh? A little fear is healthy sometimes, Jesse. Whatever Ivor is hiding in here, it will be extremely well guarded. This way, I suspect. I'd feel better about this if Axel and Lucas were here. Come on! Is this... a maze? It would appear so. A massive one from the looks of it. If Ivor used the command block to build this, it could hold unspeakable peril. Why do I have a bad feeling about this? Because some part of you still knows Ivor. Fortunately, this seems to be the only way forward. There has to be another way. A secret door, or... I don't know. Some way around. We followed Ivor to the Far Lands. We might as well keep going. Here we go. Into another dungeon of doom. I've ever seen. The far lands may be perilous, but they are indisputably fascinating. We should probably keep moving.
guys, looks like this is a... Oh no! Jesse! <laughs> There's too many! We can't fight them all! Everyone, back! Who needs to climb when you have a potion of leaping? Guys, climb the vines! Well, that worked, I suppose. Yeah, I guess. But now what do we do? We're all separated. Let's just head that way and find a place where the pads connect. Sure hope they don't get lost in there. I hope I don't get lost in there. Olivia! Stone blocks, some pistons. I wonder what this thing's supposed to be. Hello? Anyone? Olivia, is that you? Jesse, there you are. <coughs> I thought I'd never find you. All those dead ends back there. Have you found a way out of here? A way out? I only just found you. This maze? We don't have time for this. Who even knows where the others are by now? I mean, the clock's ticking here, Jesse. Yet we're lost in some elaborate puzzle. 
Well, we've got to push on to Ivor's lab somehow. Too bad there's a gaping bottomless pit in the way. What about this thing? Could it get us across? It's some kind of flying barge. It would probably get us to the other side. But it's in really bad shape. And it's really complicated. You can fix it though, right? I don't know. I think it's out of my league. I wish I'd had more time to study with Eligard. She could have fixed this thing right up. Can't be that complicated, not if it's something Ivor built. Half built, which means it was hard enough that he got stuck and gave up. This layout doesn't even make any sense. What was Ivor thinking? Or maybe it's just me. I mean, Eligard herself said I don't have what it takes to be a great engineer. She was right, I just can't hack it. I might as well be a carrot farmer. So prove her wrong. Show the world what you're made of. Prove her wrong? Jesse, she was the greatest redstone engineer ever. She was in the Order of the Stone. Sure, but the Order are still people, just like us. Right, just like us. I mean, how are we the ones saving the world when even they don't have what it takes? Soren and Ivor are always at each other's throats. The greatest warrior in history has wither sickness. All I ever see Magnus do is argue, and we both know what happened to Eligard. If the Order can't do this, how are we supposed to? How are we supposed to do anything? We're nobody. You know what? We're better than them. Better than the Order? I don't know about that. I mean, they defeated an Ender Dragon. Can you name even one thing we've done right? And I don't mean managing to stay alive. Something that actually matters. Well, for starters, we're the ones who brought them back together again. You found Eligard, I found Magnus. We both played a role with Soren. Yeah, I suppose that's true. Ah, all right. I'll try it one more time. Wait a second. I think I see what he was trying to do. Jesse, take this piston, craft it into a sticky piston, then place it on the other side of the barge, along with a redstone block. You got all that? I think so. Ivor kept some redstone dust handy. And a slime ball. The sooner the better. Okay, let's put the redstone block where it's supposed to go and place these pistons. Holy cow, we did it! We need flint and steel to get it started. I'm proud of you, Olivia. Thanks, Jesse. And thanks for everything you said just before. It really helped. No problemo. This way! This way! Run! Go, go, go! Quick, onto the barge!
was close. Everyone okay? For the moment. Slime! I'm remembering something with slime. And ch chickens. Or maybe they were ducks? There was a big gathering of people. And, and we were looking for a man with a sword. Yes, that's how we got to Gabriel after his keynote speech. Weird. Yeah, I kind of remember. Wait, Ugh, it's already fading. Fading and gone. Take my advice, Petra. Some stories are better left forgotten. lands is nothing to laugh about. Let's go see what he's hiding in there. How can one person need this many books? We should be careful. This place could be booby-trapped. Let's just start looking for the enchanting book. Hey, Olivia, I think there's some redstone over here. Looks like a circuit. We probably just need a lever to power it. Well, it's a good thing I still have one from, like, ages ago. <laughs> like, it was made for it. Let's see what this sucker does. Way. Cool! Why would you build a secret passage in a house that nobody ever visits? More like, why wouldn't you? Secret passageways are cool. Good point. anymore stay there we'll head down and see what we can find whoa what is all this huh. incredible he's gathered them all in one place gathered what exactly the treasures of the order of the stone Stories I could tell about these dusty old things. I don't see any enchanting books, though. Maybe through there? Uh, locked, of course. There must be some way to open it. These gas tears? They're super hard to get. You don't know the half of it. It was our first official mission as the Order of the Stone. We fought those ghasts for hours, and these tears were our reward. Wow. Jesse, what are you doing? Uh, taking this really cool, rare item. We might need it to unlock that door. Uh, very well. Just be careful with it. See? Soren, is this the actual Ender Dragon egg? Huh. Alas, yes. The only thing that remains of our final adventure together. No way I'm leaving this behind. These are prismarine crystals. You can only get these underwater, right? Precisely. 
We nearly ran out of oxygen getting these. <laughs> Eligard had to use a spare bucket just to grab a few extra breaths. We used most of these to craft a sea lantern. This is all that remained. Prismarine is such a cool word. Prismarine. So where'd this packed ice come from? Uh, we brought it back from the ice plane spikes biome. It was colder there than anywhere we'd ever been, but <laughs> Magnus slipped so many times our laughter kept us warm. After that, we knew we were ready to face the Ender Dragon. Ooh, cold and slippery. Am I crazy or is this a sea lantern? Ah, the very same one the Order built all those years ago. Oh, we were so green back then. It looks just as bright as on the day we crafted it. A sea lantern, huh? Why is Ivor hiding a hopper in his basement? Huh, five slots. Gassed tears. Let's try them here. Ender dragon eggs, so cool. Let's try it here. Prismarine crystals. Into the hopper. Packed ice. Let's put it here. solved it. But how in the world did you know what order to put them in? There were 120 possible combinations. If I know anything, it's how much Ivor loves puzzles. Indeed he does. Nice work, Jesse. You know, I often give Ivor a hard time, but for all his complaining, his time with the order clearly meant a great deal to him. Yeah, I guess so. Anyway, let's go get that enchanting book. the stars, the Ender Dragon, with replica Ender Crystals and all. Wow, I always wondered what it looked like. Hmm, no way out. Soren, what's this thing supposed to be? It appears to be an homage to our battle with the Ender Dragon. Despite his anger, Ivor never stopped being fond of us. <laughs> he was a big part of our team, after all. This is the same Ender Dragon you and the Order of the Stone defeated, right? <laughs> no, Jesse. It's just a model. Right, that's my point. If you tell me about the battle, it can help me solve the puzzle. Ah, <sighs> if only you'd been there. It was a fight for the ages. We'd spent weeks preparing for our greatest battle ever. <laughs> So, the Ender Dragon was stronger than even I had imagined. I realized that it was drawing strength from the Ender Crystals, and that the crystals had to be destroyed. I hit the first with a perfectly placed arrow. The second I destroyed by launching myself on the shockwave of Magnus's TNT. Using only my strength and my wiles, I steered the foul beast toward the third crystal. I flew the dragon directly toward the final crystal. Ah. Only then did Gabriel deliver his famous final blow. Yeah. We became heroes, and eventually, legends. The greatest the world has ever known. Soren, you are so full of it. Why would you say that? You made it sound like you were the only one who mattered. I was the leader. Believe you me. Whatever. I wonder if that story will help me solve this puzzle. So Soren rode the dragon, huh? Hmm. Interesting. Aha! 
there's another door? Hey, Reuben, give me a boost, will ya? No, it, it can't be. Not here. Not after all this time. Soren, why are the Ender Crystals in the Far Lands? He kept them. The fool actually kept them. He looked me in the eye and swore. Soren, how did these get here? I mean, you can't just move Ender Crystals, right? Jesse, this isn't. This isn't what it looks like. Our story, uh, the story, it's, it's mostly true. I swear, I swear it. Whatever you're thinking, I promise I can explain. Soren, I want the truth and I want it now. I, I can't. We swore never to speak of it. I don't care. I'm afraid I haven't been honest with you, Jesse. We did defeat the Ender Dragon, but it, it wasn't exactly like I said. How not exactly? We got rid of it, but we didn't kill it, per se. In fact, we didn't even fight it. We didn't even try. Soren, just spit it out. What happened? You want the truth? We used that damned command block! You used the command block to defeat the Ender Dragon? I'm afraid so. I knew your story didn't add up. Understand. When I found that blasted lock, we were nobodies. But with its help, we became stronger. Faster, we could do so much more. The others had no idea what I was doing. Yet the more I used it, the more we came to depend on it. I knew it was only so long before someone would find out. So, I concocted a plan. I would use the command block to blink the Ender Dragon out of existence. Securing our status as legends, forever. We told the world we defeated a dragon. And the rest is history. Soren, you cheated. You, you worse than cheated. You're a fraud. Believe me, I know. So you finally admit it. Soren, how could you? I've... How long have you guys been standing there? Long enough that they heard the whole thing. You lied to the whole world? You didn't think you could keep it secret forever, did you, Soren? The truth hurts, doesn't it? But Ivor... Why? Why? Why did you do this? I just wanted to hear Soren confess to his lies. Guess that worked. Soren, Gabriel, Magnus, Eligard... They agreed to keep this a secret. And you, you agreed to stay quiet too, in exchange for all of our treasures. <gasps> I've technically never told anybody. Jesse discovered the truth on his own. So this whole thing, the wither you unleashed, it's all been to teach the Order a lesson? To teach the world a lesson. To show you who the Order really are. Liars, cowards. And now, they know. Ivor, you're a madman. 
In all your scheming to expose the Order, you've nearly destroyed the known world! Look, my wither plan obviously backfired. You think? I didn't know we'd end up with three of those things tearing the world apart. Whoa. I almost forgot for a moment. Well, they are! And while we sit around, talking about your dysfunctional order of liars, those things are still out there, wrecking the world! Jesse's right. Destroying the command block is all that matters anymore. How ironic that the best thing the command block gave us was the very means to destroy it. Spare us the poetry. It's not your strong suit. This thing better work, because if it doesn't... You don't need to say it. Follow me. I'll show you. Ivor? I'm sorry. About everything. Yes, well, it doesn't matter now. Grab some ingredients and craft a weapon. I'll show you how to enchant it. Sweet. Let's see what Ivor's got in here. Let's see, there's a bunch of crafting stuff and... Diamond score! So, I can craft whatever I want, huh? Anything at all. Awesome! I've never owned a diamond weapon! Just wait till you enchant it! Let's see what this enchanting book is made of. Behold, my enchanted diamond axe! Yes, that should do the job nicely. But if you're fighting those wither monsters head on, you'll want better armor, too. I enchanted these for the Order. They're about as strong as it comes. Even able to withstand TNT. Any preference? I have eight different sets to choose from. All right, let me take a look at them. It's all quite durable. And sturdy. All right, this is the set. Yes, a fine choice. Now go ahead and put it on. How do I look? Ready for action. You can take some for your friends as well. Sounds good to me. Wow, cool armor, Jesse. Thanks. And there's plenty to go around. Now let's get back to Soren's fortress and see how the Witherstorms are doing against those Endermen. Oh, my poor fortress. I see Endermen, so this means the plan's working, right? Shouldn't the Endermen have dismantled those things already? Or am I just confused? It's not just you. Something's wrong. Jesse, over here! Axel! You guys made it! Nice freaking armor, by the way. Makes you all a lot easier to look at. Good to see you too, Axel. Axel, the cavalry has arrived. Or is it the cavalry have arrived? Eh, whatever. The Endermen, they're not angry enough. I mean, some of them are, but a lot of them are just standing around moving blocks. You know, being Endermen. Ah, oh, blast! Well, it's nothing we can't handle, right? Uh, I'm not so sure about that. Now is not the time for cold feet, Soren! So what's the plan? I mean, I know we gotta go in there, but should we just go for it, or what? We confront the Witherstorm and fight it to the death. Yeah. You do mean it's death, right? Axel, just put on your helmet. What helmet? Here. Nice. I was feeling a little left out. Guys, let's go kick some command block butt. Does anyone 
anyone see the command block? I don't think it's exposed. We need to get more Endermen focused on the Winter Star! How do you make Endermen focus? I can't even make myself focus. We, we shouldn't be here. None of this is going according to plan. Soren, what are you doing? I, uh, you know, I've, I've really enjoyed meeting you all, but... Soren! Did Soren just run away? Soren, you coward! I can't believe you! I can. Jesse, you can handle things out here, right? What? I can't let him get himself killed! Just get to the command block and destroy it! Soren! So much for the mighty order of the stone. It doesn't matter. We have work to do. We need to get those Endermen to attack it! The tractor beam! Jesse, that's it! Make them chase you into the tractor beam! I found him near the cave. Here. All right, let's see how you like this. Ruben, can you give me a little help? They're falling for it. How do you like that, you purple-eyed freak? It's working! 
working. That hole's big enough to get inside of. Now we just need to find you a way up. Or build you a way up. That's it. E everyone, empty your pockets. Let's see. I've got redstone and cobblestone from Ivor's armory. I have some TNT from Boomtown. I've got pistons, repeaters. Lucas gave me some wool. Oh, and I took some slime from the maze. Oh, and I still have that minecart. That's got to be enough to make something, right? I mean, if we use the TNT on, say... The minecart? Or those pistons. And we do have all that cobblestone. Maybe we could build a ramp or even go straight up vertically. Guys, check it out. Use the pistons, the redstone, and the TNT. Build a TNT launcher. And I climb on and you guys blast me all the way into the wither storm. <laughs> Heck yeah! I love that idea! So what are we waiting for? Let's hurry up and... Oh! Look out! Petra! Axel! Ah. Shoot! What now? There aren't enough of us. Maybe if Lucas was here. Well, he's not. Come on! Shoot! Now! Come on, we're not giving up! Okay, it's finished. Quick, climb on! Jesse, you can do this. I know you can. We all do. Thanks, guys. It means a lot. Now go demolish that command block. <laughs> Ruben, this is no place for a... Shouldn't have surprised me like that. On the other hand, I'm kind of glad not to be alone right here. Just stay close, okay? Weapon, don't fail me now. Up there and do 
toward the command block. Stay here, Reuben. I mean it this time. Anything goes wrong, I don't want you caught up in it. Bet you can't catch me! Why did I have to look down? Ruben, I believe in you! Jump! I'll catch you! You did it! I knew I could count on you! Time to put an end to this thing once and for all. Ruben! Hold on, buddy! Jesse, are you all right? We thought you were... I mean, I didn't think you'd made it. Guys, I did it! I destroyed the command block! I know, we saw! It was so freaking awesome. They're gonna be talking about you forever. Seriously? I remember! I remember! You remember what? I remember everything! Oh, Petra, I'm so happy for you! Hey, do you guys hear something? Reuben! <gasps> oh no! Reuben! You're gonna be fine, you hear me? Come on, Reuben, say something. Get up, Reuben, get up. You can't just give up on me. Not now.
was a great pig. People used to look at me like that once, Jesse. Perhaps they deserve to know the truth about the Order. All those lies we told them. Maybe I should finally come clean. You're right. They do deserve to know. We all owe a great debt to Jesse and his friends. But I owe a debt to you people as well. Which is why, there is something I want to tell you, about the Order. The Order of the Stone is not what you all believed. We were frauds. We used the command block to falsify our legacy. We were no heroes. So it is time for the world to celebrate new heroes. Real heroes. Thank you. Thank you, everyone. I know you think I'm up here because I saved the world or something. But the truth is, I didn't do it alone. Far from it. You see, I, I also had my pig, Reuben. I mean, everybody loves pigs, right? Yeah, well, me most of all. I mean, he was basically our mascot. Nobody called him that, but that's what he was. I'll really miss the little guy. We all will. Anyway, it's crazy to think my friends and I started out in a treehouse, and now we've been to some of the weirdest places in the world. I mean, come on, we traveled through the nether by minecart. How cool is that? But when all was said and done, you know what really mattered? Finishing what we set out to do. Because there's no way we were going to let a world this cool get torn apart. We did it! <laughs> Je 
Jesse, this is the Nether Star that dropped when the Witherstorm was destroyed. You want to do the honors? Oh man, this is going to be so cool. to introduce to you the new Order of the Stone. And so it was that a new Order of the Stone was born, one whose adventures were only just beginning. For though the world had been saved, and the command block destroyed, there are many more worlds than just this one. 